Thank you for joining us and welcome to the public hearing for the catastrophe modeling and rate making rulemaking. The purpose of this hearing is to provide the public with an opportunity to comment on Commissioner Lara's proposed regulations. Our next speaker is actually Carl Sussman. Thank you, Deputy Commissioner, for the few moments to chat this morning. Uh, my name is Carl Sussman. I'm a 30-year insurance broker, an insurance expert witness, and I host the talk radio show Insurance Hour. Let me take a few minutes to explain why catastrophe modeling in rate making is necessary. California has been long at the forefront of addressing the challenges posed by natural disasters. However, with the increased frequency and severity of wildfires and other climate related events, they have outpaced our traditional methods of assessing risk. Relying solely on historical data to project future losses is no longer sufficient. The world has changed and our tools to predict have to change as well. These regulations promote fairness. Advanced models can account for risk mitigation efforts taken by property owners and communities. When individuals invest in making their properties safer by clearing brush, installing fire resistant material or implementing other safety measures, they deserve to see those efforts reflected in their insurance rates. These guidelines provide that. Not only does it reward proactive behavior, but it also incentivizes widespread adoption of risk reduction strategies. Recently, I was asked uh, whether I believe the Department of Insurance and the Insurance Commissioner have guarantees from the insurance industry that they will re-enter the California insurance marketplace if these regulations are put into place. It was clear right away that this was a lose-lose question. If the answer is yes, then some might claim, oh, the insurance commissioner is being controlled by the insurance companies. If the answer is no, others might say, well, then what's the point of all the changes? But the reality is straightforward. The sustainable insurance strategy and specifically utilizing forward-looking catastrophe modeling creates an environment which insurance carriers can compete effectively. When they compete, there's availability and affordability. I'm aware that there are some concerns being raised regarding black box underwriting, suggesting that these new regulations would allow insurers to use catastrophe models without disclosing their methodologies to the insurance commissioner and the Department of Insurance. So let me tell you right now, this is not true. Just read the guidelines. The proposed changes include the establishment of what's called the pre-application required information determination procedure. I don't say it 10 times fast. This process allows the public, consumer representatives, and the Department of Insurance to thoroughly investigate the inner workings of the catastrophe models. So anytime this morning you hear someone talking about black box underwriting, take out your bingo card and just write PRID. That is what is in the actual regulations, the pre-application required information determination. This procedure allows all information relevant to rate making made fully available for public inspection as mandated by insurance code 1861.07. At the same time, the procedure respects proprietary information that is not pertinent to rate making, ensuring that trade secrets do remain protected. This balance promotes openness without compromising the intellectual property of the model developers. It literally is providing the public with more information than they are getting under today's current regulations. Okay, you might hear some folks this morning bemoaning these updated regulations. I think we should do as we heard earlier, let's not attack before something has even happened. And before you take any of those complaints to heart, just look to see who the people are complaining and what they have to lose versus what the California consumer has to gain. The insurance market is in free full, full free fall right now Coverage isn't available. The fair plan is bloated beyond its design parameters. Large insurers are having financial difficulties or leaving California. This isn't the time for politics or for special interest groups to try and stay relevant. It's about math and creating an environment where the insurance companies can compete for business. It isn't about helping one person or organization. It's about maintaining the viability of the entire insurance industry in California. Thank you. Thanks for watching. If you found this useful, please be sure to like and subscribe for more content. And don't forget, click here to watch the next video.